Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Leo. So this is going to be your daily reading, guys, for your general energies and also for your love energies, Leo. So let us see what's coming up for your general energies, guys, and then we'll be moving on to your love energies, Leos. Let us see what is coming up for your general energies, Leos. Leos, what is coming up for your general energies, Leos? We have the rider, the dog. So obviously, guys, you are very, very loyal to the people around you. And once you uh, give love to people, it's just like you lose yourself or you don't care even if you lose yourself. You just love the people around you so much. If you love the people around you so much, it's just like you will do anything for this person. You will manifest anything for them. That is how you are generally, guys. Okay. So I hope you got the overall energies, my lovely Leos. I also see here that today someone might come towards you and propose to you or someone might like um, start talking to you is what I'm getting here. Okay, and you might be really, um, might really like this person a lot. You might feel really attracted to this person you really are happy to have this person in your life okay so so let us see what's coming up for your love energies guys We have the adjustments are required. We have emotions are running high. So guys, like if you think something is not working out, if you feel like some people are not good enough for you, please let go of the situation. You don't have to like always manifest whatever you should and you you don't have to be that way guys if you feel something is not working out if you feel like you need to manifest if you feel things are not uh, happening according to expectations just let go you don't have to focus too much on the energy you don't have to focus too much on the people around you is what i'm getting here guys okay so just do whatever you have to do manifest whatever you have to manifest kind of like stay happy and excited with your energy in general guys my lovely leos So your person, for some of you, this person will come soon. You don't really have to worry because I see here for some of you that you are panicking. You really think that this person will not come towards you or you're really feeling irritated about this person or whatever it is, guys. So make just make sure that you are not irritated, you're not feeling sick or whatever it is so that is what i'm getting here guys i hope you got the overall energies now my lovely leos thank you all so much for watching guys don't uh, give all your emotions to this person and 
make sure that you're drained don't be like that because if you're going to drain yourself and if you're going to stay too emotional to the person who doesn't deserve your emotions guys it is just going to get you this um it's just going to give you the sick energy okay so bye guys see you all tomorrow bye hi guys welcome back to my channel my love leaves so this is going to be just a uh, pick a card reading for you guys i will be using the psychic tarot of the heart and also the right away deck today for your pick a card reading so this pick a card reading is all it's going to be about how this person feels about you what i'm thinking about this relationship and this is going to be totally different from yesterday's reading okay because yesterday was kind of a message reading and if you didn't watch yesterday's reading please make sure to uh, go and watch the yesterday's reading so now i will just uh, start off with the reading guys pick a card reading this is going to be of how this person thinks about you how they feel about you this is not going to be like a message from this person but definitely this is going to be from a third person's point of view of how this person feels for you guys in a sense how other people think about this person how do they love you or do they care for you and all of that this is not from this person's point of view but from every other's point of view of how everyone else views your relationship that kind of a reading okay and also i will be giving you of uh, information on how this person actually feels about you so just stay tuned to watch it i'll just shuffle the cards and lay out the piles and see you all then okay guys so now i've just laid out the three piles here you can choose any file from these files or you can choose two piles if you feel like choosing two but one is more than enough but you can choose more than one if you like so just go ahead pick a pile meditate for a while and pick a pile and see you all guys this is the pile number one pile number two and pile number three so i'll see you all with the pile number one now bye guys Okay, so for those of you who chose the pile number one, we have base chakra. We have the three rider weight cards, the tower card in reverse, the world card, and we also have the three of cups. So all I can see here is that um, definitely people around this person, they obviously know about your relationship. I wouldn't say that your relationship was like a big thing to them but definitely it meant a lot definitely to these people okay they definitely felt bad with this relationship they kind of told about your relationship to everyone around you this person does really care for you i don't see anything against you with this person they do really care they do really have a lot of feelings for you they're willing to even come towards you because they have a lot of respect towards you and because of that respect they have on you they haven't actually said um, ill things about you guys okay to others so this person does really have a lot of feelings on you that is for sure and that is the main reason people feel like around them whoever they've spoken to whoever they've had this conversation about you they definitely feel like you both would come into this union you both will definitely manifest this union so the people around them have like a positive mind towards this relationship they have a positive feeling towards this relationship because this person hasn't said anything ill about you guys so they feel like the people around them feels that you will come back into this union you will um come back together so that is how this um everyone else feels about your relationship with this person but definitely this person also feels the same way they feel like maybe you are not uh, able to separate from them they're not able to separate from you so therefore they feel like they're not able to move away from you they're not able to do anything that is against you and all of that so yes guys so i hope you got the overall energies my lovelies 
and especially with the three of cups all i can see here is that a lot of celebration so this person when they come towards you they don't want this relationship to be very lame they don't want it to be very tasteless they want this relationship to start with a celebration they want to have like a new start with you they want to have a celebration kind of an energy kind of a vibe with you because they're done with all of these weird feelings they're done with all of these weird energy and now as they're done with all of these things they want to build something strong with you they want to build something that is forever with you and that is what this person is doing guys to be honest that is the main thing that they're doing now they just want to build something strong with you they just want to have that new beginning with you and they're really like working towards that okay so this is all i can see here so when this person comes towards you it is going to be in a happy mood and a happy vibe they're not going to like cry or do something that um is not really going to be attractive so then when they come towards you it is going to be like a new beginning a fresh start or something like that okay so this is what i can see here for you guys who chose the pile number one so now i will be moving on to the pile number two okay okay guys so those who chose the pile number two this is the reading for you guys we have the sacral chakra wow this is definitely a twin flame soulmate relationship that is a bond that i'm getting here out of these cards this can be a very spiritual bond because with the sacral chakra this is a very very spiritual energy we have the ace of pentacles the full card and we also have the seven of cups okay so all i can see here is that this person definitely okay i will tell you what others feel about this relationship they feel like one person is not balancing out evenly they feel like one person is too interested in this connection the other is not or they just view this relationship as a uh, single one-sided okay they don't uh, people around you don't see this relationship as a two-sided thing they just see it as a one-sided thing maybe because of your thoughts or maybe because of this person and thoughts maybe how they voiced out their feelings or maybe how you voiced out and your feelings so generally i can see here that people are not looking at this relationship as a two-sided thing they're not looking at this relationship as something with this person and you they're just looking at this from a single perspective from a singular perspective okay so that is what i can see here with the ace of pentacles with a full card and with a seven of cups all i can see here is that this person maybe felt like they took a risk while coming towards you they felt like they're taking a risk or they felt like they shouldn't take a risk because we have the full card in reverse which means something that has to be done for sure there is no time for thoughts there is no time for risk taking so this person when they come towards you it is going to be like a sure sign it is going to be like for sure so they're not jumping into something without knowing the consequences they will not jump into something without understanding the importance of it so this person is not doing anything because they feel they have to or they're not being forced into anything they're doing everything for because of their own will and you need to know that this person is very very precautious because they're taking steps and they're doing not they're not doing everything for fun or they're not doing everything because they feel they need to do it they're doing everything because they have a deep sense of belonging they feel they need to accomplish it and that is the main reason they are going with it okay what is seven of cups i can also see here that there is a lot of things that you must understand out of this connection because with the seven of cups i can see that there is a lot of choices that you have to make 
or this person has to make this stock between choices this stock between what they have to do and what they have to manifest and everything so definitely this person is very stuck in their heads they're stuck in their heads they're stuck completely and they don't really understand what they must do they don't really understand what they must live out on what they must go towards and this might be a positive sign but i'm not sure guys okay this can be a positive sign or this can also be a negative sign i'm not that sure so this is all i can see here my lovely who chose the pile number two all i can see is that this person might have had a lot of choices and maybe they're like a little bit distracted with their choices but end of the day they're going to choose you and i don't know if that is true like if they're going to choose you or not but definitely you have to go in your own path pave your own path don't trust anyone or anything even if they make the promises that even the work could make so please guys this is the only thing that i'm asking you to do just go on with the flow trust only yourselves and that is it i see here that you will be complete in your life okay so this is all i can see here my lovelies now i'll be moving on to the pile number three So those who chose the pile number three, let us just begin the reading. Oh God. So we have the dreams, daydreams and decisions. Okay, so what other people think about how these people feels about you is that they definitely feel this person has a lot of love for you because they're singing songs about you, they are daydreaming about you, they're very, very expressive, they're even boasting about how amazing they feel about you they're this kind of person who keeps talking about you they keep expressing how they feel about you because with the daydreams and decisions this is what i can say here this person's continuously talking about you they're expressing how much they love you they're expressing how much they care for you they're expressing how much they're giving in this relationship with you and it has nothing to do with boasting okay this person's also boasting a lot about you they are very very i don't know guys they're very uh, drawn to your energies they're very focused on your energy and that is the main uh, thing that i'm getting here with daydreams and decisions this person's very very concerned about you and with the ace of cups they would do anything to have this connection with you they would do anything to have this relationship with you to have this connection with you because they feel like this bond will last for a lifetime they feel like this relationship is the final connection with you and yes guys that is the main uh, thing that i'm getting here with the ace of cups with the seven of wands of swords and with the knight of swords all i can see with these three cards is that they are going to love you they are going to care for you they are going to be there for you at no matter what uh, circumstances are but the only thing this person wants from you is a little bit of truth okay i can see that if you build this relationship on truth this will last a lifetime maybe it will even last like forever like maybe lifetimes after lifetimes but the main thing that you must do is be truthful and I can also see that this person is planning to come towards you soon with the Knight of Swords. So they're going to come towards you very fast, soon. And this is all going to happen so quick. So just make your mind and just go with what you want in this life. What you want to do in this life with this person. So that is all I can see here, my lovely. Who chose the pile number three so this is all i can see here and bye guys see you all tomorrow guys bye and also if you wouldn't watch my yesterday's reading please make sure to watch that because i've given the messages this person has for you guys and i really hope it will help you on your day-to-day -day basis so bye guys more videos coming up